Welcome to MarketTamer.com and members, uh, I've got a chart up here of paychecks and there's a reason I have this chart up and I'll go through that in just a moment. But before I do, a couple of quick things. If you were to talk to a purist in the market and you were to ask them, what are the chances a stock tomorrow will go up? They'd probably say, well, there's a 50-50 a chance. So 50 chance can go up, 50 can go down. And then if you were to ask them, well, what are the chances two stocks could go up? They'd say, well, probably there's a 50-50 chance the first one and a 50-50 chance the second one. So maybe there's a 25% chance overall that both stocks will go up tomorrow. And if you start to extrapolate that over multiple stocks, you find that that probability of many, many stocks going up in any given day is actually very low. So what I wanted to do here was highlight that when you have a very powerful algorithm behind uh, a, a system, which is exactly what we have, so we've got a, a secret proprietary algorithm that spots trading ideas each and every day. And when you have that powering ideas, what you find is you uh, really skew the probabilities in your favor. And that's exactly what you want. In order to make money long term, you need to skew probabilities in your favor. So it's not just a 50-50 chance in any given day. In fact, it's much higher. So to highlight that, let me just show you a couple of the trading ideas from a couple of days ago. And the first one is PAYX. So I'll show you that here, Paychex. And the reason I'm showing it to you is because right around two days ago was when we were hitting a peak here. You'll note that uh, the stock had come up. It was hitting sort of a resistance area. It came down, came back up, hit the resistance area. And a lot of people expected that uh, this stock and many others would take a nosedive. And yet within a couple of days, what we see is that stock is up. But what's really interesting is if we move on to the next one, PNC Financial Services, which is listed here, that stock was also up. Now, what are the chances of that, given that we had two trading ideas give bullish signals? And then we move on to V, which is uh, Visa. What happened Visa? Visa has also moved up. And what we find is if we keep going through these trading ideas, JP Morgan, which was uh, a fourth trading idea, was up. Nike was up, which was another trading idea. If we look towards uh, American Tower, that was up. Move on to the uh, Spiders, S&P Retail Index, that too was up. And so we'll just go back here for a moment and take a look at these trading ideas. So we've looked at Paychex, PNC, uh, Visa, JP Morgan, Nike, and so forth. And in fact, if you were to go through this entire list of about 33 stocks, what you'd find is, I think, something like uh, possibly two of those stocks, at most three, I believe, did not have up moves subsequent to uh, the signal here. So if we were to, let's just keep going, see if we can actually find a loser in here. Uh, because these, these winners are almost getting boring. Almost every stock here is a winner, which is remarkable if you think about, and here's actually maybe our first loser. Let's just uh, come back to that point in a moment. But WellPoint Healthcare, note that it was up and it's slightly below, just very slightly below the end of the day on Wednesday. So it's, it's a very marginal loser. But if you're going to win, in the order of uh, what we're seeing here, almost every stock we're looking at is winning. And hopefully we'll come across another, no, that's not, that's another winner that closed low, opened uh, nicely higher and closed higher today. Here's another winner. Uh, if we were looking at the chances of all of these stocks being winners, we're down, where are we now on the list? We're down to Busey here, B-U-C-Y. If we were looking at the chances, the chances are almost zero that every one of these stocks would be up based on just uh, standard rational theory. And yet, once we start to look at the algorithm uh, that powers this, it, it really skews things in our favor. And so as a, a trader practicing the market, this is very, very powerful uh, material for you because what it tells you is that if you were to go through this list, the chance of every single one of these stocks moving up um, and, and the chance of getting what is it, 31 out of uh, 33 winners here. Um, probabilistically, it, it's really near zero. Uh, it's probably one in a billion. I'm sure somebody will uh, send in what, what the actual figure is. So make sure to uh, open your virtual trading accounts and start practicing because you have one of the most powerful tools at your disposal. So please do take advantage.